What's up, YouTube? How's it going? Forever King here. So I kind of wanted to give my final thoughts or current thoughts on the Mortal Kombat Chaos Reigns pack that comes with Combat Pack 2 and, you know, the DLC story expansion. Because I see a lot of people complaining like, oh, it's fifty nine ninety nine for this Chaos Reigns pack. That's like almost a whole brand new game, you know, um, which is true. Fifty nine ninety nine is <laughs> it's a steep price. Um, so if we go back to the last time this happened in Mortal Kombat 11, we got Mortal Kombat Aftermath. That was $39.99. So $20 difference. But uh, Mortal Kombat Aftermath, it had three characters. It had, what was it, Shiva, Fujin, and Robocop, I believe. So it was three characters plus a story. Uh, Chaos Reigns, it's six characters plus a story. So it is double the characters. Uh, we don't know how long the story is going to be. We can assume that it's like going to be the same length as the Aftermath story, which I only beat it once, <laughs> and it was like when it very first came out. So I don't remember exactly how long it was, but I want to say it was like less than half the length of like the actual story mode, something like that, if I'm remembering it right. So uh, it was basically like another couple chapters, you know. So... I guess we can assume the Chaos Reigns is going to be about the same length. If it was like way longer, if it was like a whole other story mode, uh, I mean, that would be cool. Uh, I don't know if that would justify the price for some people, the fifty, uh, the fifty nine ninety nine. So my main thing with it is, is like, I do wish that it came with more cameos. Like, if it was like six characters and then maybe like three or four cameos, I would be all in. I'd be like, hey, this is cool because more cameos means uh, all of the roster characters have three or four more different play styles. You know what I mean? Um, especially if they're really good cameos that kind of like change the meta of the game. Um, so that's the most unfortunate part, in my opinion, is that there's no cameos in this Chaos Reigns. It's just the six characters in the story. Uh, my other main gripe is that there's still some functions of the game that is not working, like, you know, online training mode, uh, the Warrior Shrine that's next to Combat League. Those two uh, modes, they've been there since day one, since this game released, like, almost a whole year ago. This game has been out for, what, like 10 months now? And ever since this game released... Online training mode said coming soon, and Warrior Shrine said coming soon. We don't have any like update on when online training mode is actually coming. We don't have any update on when Warrior Shrine is coming. We don't even know what Warrior Shrine is, you know? So for them to just have us pay another fifty nine ninety nine for another story expansion and six characters. I kind of wish those were taken care of, you know? Like, the online training mode and the Warrior Shrine, like, those should definitely be, and it's, it's been almost a year, you know what I mean? Like, does coming soon, does that mean, like, coming in years from now? Or, like, I don't know. Um, so, yeah, no cameos, and there's still some parts of the game that's not finished. Uh, this is my two main issues. The combat pack, the combat pack itself is fine to me. Um, I know it's all going to be opinion based at the end of the day. Like some people don't like movie characters and guest characters and stuff like that. And some people don't like gender swap characters. Uh, some people love, you know, Conan the Barbarian and stuff like that. So, to me, they're fine. Um, I always thought Cyrax and Sector were cool. So as long as they still play like your classic Cyrax and Sector, e the gender swap doesn't bother me at all. And then Noob Cybot, one of the coolest ninjas, one of the coolest Mortal Kombat characters in general. Uh, he's the character I'm the most excited for in the combat pack. As far as like Gameplay-wise, I think I'm going to be the most excited for Conan the Barbarian because we don't have like a true grappler in Mortal Kombat right now. The closest thing we have is Reiko, but 
hopefully Conan the Barbarian is like a a grappler, you know, like a like a Zangief or something, you know, so we can actually have like a a good cool grappler in this game. If that's the case, then I think Conan is my most anticipated for this combat pack too. But if if Conan is just like another brawler like Shao Kahn kind of or General Shao, then I think Noob will probably be my most anticipated. Another thing I'm wondering is, are you going to have the option to just buy the characters without buying the story? Because usually characters are, what, like $5 a character? So if it's $5 a character and there's six characters, that's $30. If you wanted to just buy the individual characters for $5 a piece, you could spend $30 and just not get the story and save yourself thirty dollars instead of paying fifty nine ninety nine for the story and the characters. Maybe we could just buy the characters without the story. Um I wonder if that's gonna be an option. Because in Mortal Kombat Aftermath, I believe they let us buy the characters individually if we wanted to. I don't think we had to buy it all. And as far as I know, there's not going to be any costumes for this either. Like, no new costumes, no new game modes. Um, it's just the six characters and the story. So is the story like <clears throat> is the story like thirty bucks on its own, and then like the six characters are like thirty bucks, and that those two added together make fifty nine ninety nine. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, I kind of I do wish that it was more to it. If the price is going to be that big, we should be getting like this Chaos Reigns pack should be giving us new game modes, it should be giving us cameos, uh costumes for characters. You know, like a lot of the DLC characters, you can't get skins or well, not just a lot of the DLC characters, all the DLC characters, you can't get skins for them by playing Combat League and through the seasons, you know? The seasonal shop doesn't give new skins to the DLC characters. So, you know, it would have been cool if maybe Chaos Reigns gave, like, skins to all the DLC characters from Combat Pack 1. That'd be more incentive to, you know, pay $59.99 for it. Just trying to figure out, like, what other things they can do. And... If we have to wait for a long time for like a combat pack three, because this is a lot of content right now, like they just dro they're dropping all of this at once in September, I believe. So we're probably not going to get a combat pack three till like way later, like 2025, way later down the road or something. And for us to just not have any cameos at all throughout that time, I'm hoping that maybe. Here and there, like once every couple months, they drop another cameo. I'm honestly interested in cameos just as much or maybe even more than I'm interested in new characters because I might not use all these characters, you know what I mean? Like I might not use Cyrax, Sector, you know, T-1000, whatever. But if there are cameos, I'm going to try every cameo with my main characters, like Garrus, Ermac, you know, like every new cameo that comes out, I'm going to try it with my character. So I would have liked for there to be cameos in this combat pack too. And if there's not going to be cameos in this, then hopefully we don't have to wait until combat pack three, which is probably going to be a long time from now to get new cameos. Hopefully they just drop cameos for us here and there. Uh, if they don't, <laughs> then hopefully Combat Pack 3 is just like a bunch of cameos, like even more cameos than characters. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. Um, tell me what you guys think in the comment section down below. Are you guys happy with the Chaos Reigns bundle overall? Are you happy with, you know, Cyrax, Sector, Conan, T-1000? Um, are you happy with the price? Yeah, tell me what you guys think. And uh, thank you guys all for watching. Hope you guys have a good night and peace.
Creation. Gyrus wins.